Hi everyone, I'm Simon Wood. With bank holiday just around the corner, what a better way to relax and enjoy it than with a perfect ribeye steak. What we've got here, we've got our steaks at room temperature that have been nicely drizzled with oil. Okay, so we've got our pan. It's screaming hot, there's nothing in there. The reason we do that is so it heats up and we can get a nice seal on this ribeye as soon as it goes in. I'm gonna pop a little bit of seasoning on there. And then we're gonna take it over to the pan. Always lay it away from you. What you don't wanna do is get any fat splashing back towards you. Now just leave that there. Don't, don't move it around, just let it sit, get a good contact with the pan. Using tongs, not a fork. We don't want to start pricking it and juice coming out, steaming the steak and making it tough. And just let that sit for a little while. Okay, so that's looking really, really good. Now you've got a nice brown caramel colour. Just season it before I turn it. Using my tongs, not a fork, because we don't want to prick it. You can let that sit for a couple of minutes and then add in some butter. As soon as that butter starts to bubble like that, base your steak. And that's going to keep it nice and moist, a nice nutty flavour. It's going to make it really, really good to eat. Add some black pepper now. Didn't put that in at the beginning because I didn't want it to scorch and burn in the pan. Now we'll just get the flavour of the pepper, which is exactly what we want. Okay, so that's our steak. It's cooked medium, so we're going to take that out of the pan, over to the board, and just let that sit there, rest and relax, and go nice and tender. Okay, so our steak's out of the pan. It's resting on the board. Gives us time to move on to our avocado and tomato salsa. This is quite simple. It's avocados, tomato, some chopped red onion, some lime juice, some dried chilli flakes, and some ground cumin and ground chilli. Just a pinch of each. That's all mixed together. The lime juice will stop that from discolouring. Um, also give it a nice zingy, fresh flavour. What we can do is just take our steak. You can see how juicy that is. Lay it on the plate. Simple serving of our salsa, just over the top. A little squeeze of lime just to make it extra vibrant. And we're just going to finish that off with some coriander. And there you have it, Aldi's 28 day matured ribeye steak that's been specially selected for you to enjoy on any bank holiday, whatever the weather.